It's unusual, but young David Hume should know what he's up to. After all, his father Joe has played cricket for Middlesex to say nothing of football for Arsenal. He's preparing it for a new plastic material which turns old bats into new. Welcomed by leading professionals, the new surface plays as well as the original Willow and in no way conflicts with the rules of cricket. Now the gluing stage is over and it's time to apply the cover which extensive tests prove can lengthen the life of a bat at least four times. The bat can be shaved down and sandpaper to compensate for the extra weight and the result is a surface completely waterproof that requires no oiling. And to appreciate its virtues, who better than Alan Fairfax, Australian test cricketer, coach and writer on the game? His opinion is that apart from prolonging the life of the bat, the new cover in no way affects its driving power. The fitting is a very simple operation and it's a boon for those who have to provide good equipment in quantity for young people. Splits and cracks look like being things of the past. And here's Morris Tate, the famous Sussex bowler, sending a few down to Peter Smith, the Essex batsman. Nicely played, sir. But hello, what's happened? It's an old story to any cricketer, amateur or pro, that telltale crack. But now it's no longer a tragedy. Here's Fairfax with something up his sleeve, or at least in his hands. Come on, try this. Fair enough, thinks Peter Smith. Let's have it, Morris. That feels good enough. Any complaints, asks Fairfax. It seems the new plastic cover lives up to its claims. A little application, 24 hours to dry, and there you are.